Hey Cards fans, Barry K with Cards for Days, and today I'm going to do a comparison video of a hot corner box versus fat packs. I got a lot of comments on my uh, last video where I featured hot corner boxes and I thought they were not as hot as they used to be. And a lot of the comments, or there were multiple comments that said, man, I'd just rather put my the $15 towards fat packs. So I thought, okay, let's compare $15 of a hot corner box and three of the 2019 update fat packs and see uh, which one comes out as a better buy. Um, now it's a very different product. You know, this one's gonna have some um, some hits in it and you know, the chance of something uh, from a different year, you know, the packs are gonna be the same as we've seen in 2008 and then there'll be some 2019s, but this, we know what we're going to get from update. But anyway, before I get started, I wanted to show off another mail item that I got today. And this comes from Greg Lowry, uh, an, an excellent member of the baseball card community. Uh, and he sent me just a team bag of Cubs cards. Everybody knows I'm a Cubs fan and Javier Baez is my main PC. So we've got a nice Donruss optic there. But then he's got some really cool... You know, this Chris Bryant ro Rookie of the Year, Roy. I don't think it's his nickname, or maybe that is his nickname. I don't know. Chris Bryant from 2019 update. And then these are very cool. Wilson Contreras Yellow and Jose Quintana. Um, the, these are the Walgreen Yellow inserts. These are hard to come by. I've, not, I've looked for Walgreen packs. I haven't found any. Nice Anthony Rizzo from Topps Chrome. Anthony Rizzo from Series 2, I believe that is. Series 1 of 2018. We got a Thomas Hatch, first Bowman. And then some older cards, and these are really cool. Lee Smith. This is, you know, the classic 88 tops design. And that's, you know, actually really nice centered. That's a great card. Mark Grace from 92 Upper Deck. Cool landscape shot of him hustling out a, you know, a bat. We got Donruss. Diamond Kings and a studio. And there's a checklist card for 91. And we got some cool Ryan Sandbergs. We got the 89. Is that 89 or 90? 90. 90. One. Oh, I was way off. 91 tops. And then check out this Ryan Sandberg. This is 92 tops. And I did not remember this series, but it looks doesn't even look like a photograph. It looks like art almost, but it is a photograph. And then check this one out. This is super cool. This pinnacle, Ryan Sandberg, he was an amazing fielder. Heads up, two hands. Uh, that's just a cool, cool card. And there's what the back looks like from pinnacle. And then the Damon Berry Hill Gold Cup. So awesome, awesome. Thank you so much. Those are very cool. Uh, so let's get to the hot corner box versus the packs. We'll start with the hot corner box because I've most recently um, ripped this. Um, but in it, you get one hobby pack, two hits, and four total packs. The packs of these have been 2019 Series 1. Uh, I did get a Topps Fire pack in one, but you're guaranteed the hobby box packs are always the same. So let's leave the hits in there until the end, because I think that's the best bang for your buck. There's the hobby pack that is in every single one of these. 2008 Donner's Elite. And then we've got a... ooh. So this is different. Uh, 2019 Series 2. That is a great pack. And that is one of the hits. And then we've got Donruss. Is this 91? I think it is with this orange. 1990 Donruss or the Diamond King. So I think this is 91, but we'll see. And then the last pack. Trying to do a reveal. Check that out. Donruss Optic 2018. So these are actually much better packs. I bought them all at the same time and I opened a bunch on video, but these are uh, much better. So here we go. Our auto is a junior. Is that Her Herndon? Junior Herndon from Just Miners 1999. Just. I've never seen that series before. And I've never heard of that player. So there's our auto. And then our relic or other hit is Aramis Ramirez for the Cubs. All-Star Stitches. So he's got his orange All-Star jersey. That's pretty cool. And as a Cubs fan, I like it. The top loader, or the penny sleeve, is all beat up. But we can replace that. That's a pretty cool relic card. And I don't mind relic cards. 
All right, so let's open this. We've seen these packs before. This is every single uh, hobby box or hot corner box has had these packs. We've got Brad Hand, Josh Reddick, UD Valdez, Zach McAllister, and Jeremy Farrell. I don't think I've gotten much of anything out of those. Let's go to our junk wax. See if I'm right. If it is 91. 90. Okay. That makes sense. So these are 19... 90 dollars. Kevin Seitzer. Tim Belcher. Jesse Barfield. Hey, Wade Boggs. I'm actually going to spend some time tonight looking for some Wade Boggs cards to do a trade. Doyle Alexander, Chris Bazio, Jeff Ballard, there's a Bo Jackson, a checklist. I do like how they put players on checklist now, mix it instead of a worthless card, something. Ken Hill, Dwight Smith, Cubs card, Terry Leach, Dean Palmer, Vance Law, another Cubs, Jeff Musselman, and Don August, and there's the wax on the back of that. But here we go. We got two pretty decent packs out of this. Let's go with the 18 Optic. Definitely have seen a lot of Optic being broken on YouTube channels and in different communities because they're just a good quality card and a lot of good players. So Eddie Matthews, Brian Dozier, got a Chipper Jones Gold, and those are not numbered. They're just inserts, and the Mick. So, <clears throat> those are the 2018 Donner's Optic, and now 2019 Series 2, so this is probably the best, or at least has the best chance for some good rookies from 2019. Nick Chiufo, and that, I mean, it looks like a short print, but it is not. Ivan Nova, Matt Harvey, there's a Yusei Kikuchi. There's the Javier Baez, Windy City Warriors, and Wilson Contreras. And the White Sox. The Rockies, a lot of team cards. Ooh, and we get the uh, iconic cards of Bo Jackson. Check that out. Nice card. Ronnie Rodriguez, rookie. Jorge Bonifacio, used to be a cubby. Isaac Galloway, rookie. Colin McHugh. Ryan Braun, and Greg Bird. So none of the, the key rookies there. So even though the the packs were better, or at least different, uh, we did not get lucky on any of those. Although I do like the Iconic Card series. So there we go. That is the Hot Corner Box. 15 bucks. So now let's compare. What if we bought three fat packs? Is that a better uh, use of money? Is it more fun? Let's see if we have more fun. Let me know what you guys think we're going to find. We've got, right off the bat, Kevin Biggio, rookie. So are we going to get a Yastrzemski in here? Derek Holland, and there's the Yastrzemski rookie card. Michael Pineda. Yusei Kikuchi, rookie debut. Omar Navarez. Tyson Ross. Dallas Keuchel. John Duplantier. Jason Martin. Christian Walker. Scott Alexander. It looks like we do have a foil. Hopefully it's somebody good. Masahiro Tanaka, Pacific Power, these rookie combos, and it is a Kyle Bearclaw foil. And we got, is this an iconic card? Yep. Ivan Rodriguez, then the Bryce Harper, welcome to Philly, Mel Ott, we've got a Kevin Gutierrez, Kelvin Gutierrez rookie, AJ Pollock, Brad Boxberger, Billy Hamilton, Richie Martin, Mike Ford rookie, Nick Hundley, Wilson Contreras All-Star Games, George Springer, Daniel Vogelbach, J.P. Crawford, Tanner Rourke, J.T. Real Muto, and Luis Quesa, Cesa. So we got the BGO and the Yastrzemski rookies. And for pack number two, right on the top, check it out. The top has been fire. Vladdy G rookie card. So, so far, two packs in, I already think that that's a more enjoyable rip 
And we're not even, I mean, we're one card in. Brandon Brennan, Jose Iglesias, John Ryan Murphy, Ismani Grandal, Nick Ramirez, rookie, as Drupal Cabrera, Gregory Soto, DJ LeMayhew, Brian Reynolds, rookie, Southside Warriors, there's a Shane Bieber All-Star Game card, Jose Barrios, Kyle Dowdy, rookie, Richard Lovelady, rookie, Andrew Miller, Marcus Stroman, Greatest Moments, then these Bryce Harper cards, and we got a Vladimir Guerrero Sr., Perennial All-Stars, Randy Johnson, Greatest Players, Joey Gallo, Greg Holland, Gary Sanchez, the um, CC Sabathia, 3,000 Ks, Jordan Lyles, 2,000 RBIs for Pujols, an Elvis Luciano rookie, Alex Bregman, Home Run Derby, Oscar Mercado, Lucas Gilito, All-Star Game, Amir Garrett, Austin Meadows, All-Star, Frankie Montas, and Jerickson Profar. So two of the packs down, one to go. Let's see who we can find on top of this one. I'm going to be disappointed if we get, if we don't get somebody great. Lane Thomas, Rookie. It has been a rookie on top of each one of those. Alex Colon, Braden Bishop, Marco Estrada, Adrian Sampson, rookie, Francisco Liriano. We got another Cavan Biggio. I think, yeah. Derek Holland, and then the Mike Yastrzemski. Michael Pineda, Masahiro Tanaka, Pacific Power, rookie combos. Jared Walsh, rookie card. Checking out the numbers on that one. So that number is 010, which I think is the standard number. So maybe that one at the very beginning was a short print that I flipped over. Let me look at that again. What card was that that I flipped it over? Oh, no. And it was like 6-2. It was like 3-6-2. Oh, sorry, guys. We're slowing this video down. What was it? What was it? Bryce Harper, A.J. Pollock, Mel Ott, Brad Boxberger, Billy Hamilton, Mike Ford. I will recognize it when I see it. Dan Rourke. Or was it out of series... It was out of the series, too. Never mind. My uh, memory is going crazy. All right, but anyway, back to these cards. Let's not overlook this Walker Bueller Gold Cup All-Star Game. That's a good card. Kyle Bird. You guys are yelling at your screen right now. A Zach Plezak Rookie Card Gold. That is numbered out of 1638. Bryce Harper. Here's a Garrett Hampson. I like the inserts when you get rookie cards. Nice Nolan Arenado, Perennial All-Stars. Corbin Martin, rookie, debut. Aaron Brooks, Russell Martin, David Robertson, Matthew Beattie, rookie, Kyle Bearclaw, Jonathan Scope, Jorge Polanco, Josh Bell, Jan Gomes, Aroldis Chapman, Tyro Estrada, and Paul DeYoung. All right, so let's do a quick comparison I think I know, and I think that you guys are right, that the $15 might be better spent on the fat pack. So these are just the, you know, quote, hit piles that I pulled aside. Nolan Arnato, Garrett Hampson, rookie, Zach Please at gold, whatever. Walker Bueller, gold cup, that's nice. Then I got two Yazas and Biggios. Here's a Randy Johnson, Vladdy G, Vladdy Jr. Wilson Contreras, that's for me. Ivan Rodriguez, we got a foil, Kikuchi, so that was a lot of fun, uh, definitely more cards, whereas here, I don't know, I pulled out that Bo Jackson, and then a Cubs card for me. I did get a Yusei Kikuchi rookie from Series 2. I did like this Aramis Ramirez relic. The uh, Other than the factor of I had not seen that type of card before, I don't know the player, so those were the hits. Um, but you can just see in comparing cards versus 
you know, there's the $15 of 2019 update, and there's the hot corner box comparison. Um, definitely, uh, I definitely got some good packs in this one versus the other one. I unfortunately didn't get many. Uh, I guess 2018, I was looking for rookies. Uh, the Chipper Jones Gold is nice, and the Mickey Mantle is always nice. Um, but then these are pretty much garbage. So there you have it. I think the verdict is out. Uh, spending 15 bucks on the fat packs is probably a more fun, more satisfying rip. Uh, but especially if you get a Vladdy Jr. and a couple good rookie cards. So I appreciate everybody watching. Let me know. Do you guys agree with that statement that spending your money on fat packs is probably the way to go? I tend to agree with everybody. There you have it. Uh, stay tuned. We'll come out with a new video tomorrow, and I'll try to keep my, uh, we'll try to get some good luck going with some of the stuff I have coming up. Everybody, take care and have a good week. Bye.